To me, Kenny Mayne has to be considered one of the worst dancers in Dancing with the Stars history. Even though there were a lot of not good celebrity dancers throughout during the show, but this one was ultimately the worst. So let's get into it. Kenny Mayne is a sports journalist for ESPN. He currently appears as the host of Kenny Mayne's Wider World of Sports, which is on the ESPN website. And he appeared as a weekly contributor to the Sunday NFL Countdown with his weekly podcast called Main Event. During the early 2000s, he would join the second season of Dancing with the Stars, being partnered up with Andrea Hale, which is her first season as a pro. The first season, they had six couples, and in the second season, they expanded to four, making it ten. When Kenny first got onto the dance floor, it was anything but a complete disaster. Dancing the cha-cha-cha, Kenny Mayne and his partner, Andrea Hale. I think your, your sports background was really obvious when you waved off one of your own dance moves. That was, that, I've never seen that. Well, we never really excelled at that, so. I th uh, I and we didn't tonight either. Well, no, well, let's, let's, this being let's, judged? Not, pre let's not prejudge. No, let's who are they to judge me anyway? Well, they're about to let you know, unfortunately. Uh, <laughs> Carrie Ann. How are you guys tonight? I don't even know what Thank to you. say. Now, now you want to hear it? <laughs> now, actually, you know what? I appreciate it and loved your commitment. That was the most committed dance, if you want to call it dance, I've ever seen. Compared. But I'm not going to make any more comments on your dance. All right, Bruno. <laughs> that was demented. It was like Pinocchio chasing Jeepity Cricket across the room. It couldn't have been more wooden. Oh, oh, Bruno, listen to me. Now, you'll see. Never knock a trier. This man has Not come out here. He has the courage to come out and dance. My feeling is he is a ball and dancer. Next week, if he's back. I got it yes. from John Crawford. Tina, give me the axe. No, Bruno. Bruno, this man is going to be good. I'm All right. So good You're going right. to come good. Don't you worry. You know what? Let you were Samoa voting for him. <laughs> <laughs> the judges have their scores. Carrie Ann Inaba. Four. Ben Goodman. Five. Bruno Tignoli. Four. Thirteen. Thirteen out of thirty, Kenny and Andrea. Now, I know that you are already a winner to so many men out there just for getting onto the dance floor, but you were worried about people laughing at you. What made you do this competition? I don't know. Really, right now. <laughs> uh, I don't think the Italian judge understood what we were trying to portray out there. It was supposed to be two children lost in the woods and there's a snowstorm. <laughs> And then the tanks are coming, but yet we hide under the bridge. And then we capture each other at the end. And we almost drop the girl, but she has fancy sequins. I pick her up. I'm married already, okay? But I'm just escorting her through the woods. Yikes. That was bad. But look on the bright side, Kenny. At least they were not harsh towards you. But the bad news is, he was voted off the same night. 
So Kenny Mayne's dance with the star stats were this. One dance, 13 points, and an average score of 13. During the 200 episode, he would actually get an award for the worst dancer ever in Dance with Stars history. He's a good ESPN sportscaster and host, but the bad news is he will always be known as a Dancing with the Stars bus and one of the worst celebrity dancers in Dancing with the Stars history. And that'll do it for this video. Like, subscribe, and comment down below for any suggestions you want me to do. And I also want to wish all the mothers out there happy Mother's Day. And once again, that'll do it for another video. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is Eric Sharkey. Catch you next time.